Security Architecture and Design Security architecture and design is the process of designing and implementing secure systems and networks that protect an organization's assets from cyber threats. It involves considering the various security risks and vulnerabilities that an organization faces, and designing systems and processes to mitigate or eliminate those risks. Effective security architecture and design involves a number of key steps, including Identifying and prioritizing assets. The first step in designing a secure system is to identify the assets that need to be protected. This includes both physical assets, such as servers and networking equipment, and digital assets, such as data and software. It's important to prioritize these assets based on their value to the organization and the potential impact of a breach. Assessing risks and vulnerabilities. Once you've identified the assets that need to be protected, you'll need to assess the risks and vulnerabilities that those assets face. This includes identifying potential threats, such as cyber attacks, as well as the vulnerabilities that those threats could exploit. Implementing controls. Based on your risk assessment, you'll need to implement controls to mitigate or eliminate the identified risks. This could include things like firewalls, intrusion detection systems, and encryption. It's important to choose controls that are appropriate for the specific risks and vulnerabilities that you're trying to mitigate. Designing the security architecture. Based on the controls you've chosen, you'll need to design the security architecture that will be used to protect your assets. This includes designing the physical layout of the system, as well as the logical structure of the network and the relationships between different components. Testing and verifying the design. Once you've designed the security architecture, it's important to test and verify that it's effective at mitigating the identified risks. This can be done through a variety of methods, including penetration testing, security audits, and vulnerability assessments. Ongoing maintenance and review. Security architecture and design is an ongoing process, and it's important to regularly review and update your security measures to ensure that they remain effective. This could include things like patching vulnerabilities, updating security policies, and conducting regular risk assessments. Overall, security architecture and design is a critical component of an organization's cybersecurity strategy. By carefully considering the risks and vulnerabilities that an organization faces, and implementing appropriate controls, it's possible to significantly reduce the likelihood of a cyber attack or data breach. Please subscribe to this channel for continued learning.